Alice Keetler was a descendant of Flemish merchants born in 1263 in County Kilkenny, Ireland. There are scant records of her life in general, but what is known is that she had a total of four husbands who all died abruptly or mysteriously. All of them were successful in some way, be they moneylenders, merchants or landowners. Trouble began for Alice in 1302, when she and her second husband, Adam Blund, were accused of killing her first husband, William Outlaw. She seems to have had no love from her neighbours and local people, for she was very well off financially from money lending and her inheritance. John Lepoe, her fourth husband, was a local law official who arrested another official for attempting to apprehend Kittler for murder. Then, in 1324, Lepoe fell ill himself and blamed Alice for poisoning him. The death of her fourth husband seems to have opened the floodgates of accusations against Kittler for Lepoy's children, and all of her stepchildren claimed she was a practiser of poisoning and witchcraft. Seven charges were then brought against Alice by the local court for denying the power of Christ, sacrificing animals to demons, asking demons for advice, having sex with an incubus, convening coven meetings, making dark magic poisons, and bewitching and killing her husbands. Alice did not stick around to face her accusers, fleeing Ireland never to return. In her place, the court tried her loyal servant, Petronilla de Meath, and promptly found her guilty. She was burned alive at the stake on November 3rd, 1324. This case seems to be one that was based on jealousy and contempt on the part of Keitler's neighbours and stepchildren. With the death of each of her wealthy husbands, she inherited a substantial sum and would almost immediately remarry another wealthy man. Arousing suspicions and sealing Alice and her poor servants' fates, 